Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Sometimes you may want to sort data using a sort order that isn't ascending or descending. These are called custom sort orders. An example of a custom sort order would be the chronological sorting of the days of the week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. You can create your own custom sort orders in Excel. Once they are created, custom sort orders are available to all worksheets in Excel. To create a custom sort order, type the items that you would like to have in the custom sort order, in the order you would like them to appear, down a column within the worksheet. Then click and drag over the items to select them. Next, if you're using Microsoft Office Excel 2007, then click the Microsoft Office button and select the Excel Options button to display the Options dialog box, where you can click the Popular category at the left side of the dialog box. Now if you're using Microsoft Office Excel 2010, click the File tab in the ribbon and then click the Options command and this time choose the Advanced category at the left side of the dialog box. Then in either version, simply click the Edit Custom Lists button that appears at the right side of the dialog box. That will open the Custom Lists dialog box. In this dialog box, you'll see a reference to the currently selected cell range in the text box that appears in the lower right corner. Simply click the Import button to import the contents of the selected cells into the List Entries box. The Custom Sort Order will also appear in the Custom Lists box on the left side of this tab. Note that you can also delete custom lists that you have created in this tab as well. To delete a custom list that you've created, you would just select it from the Custom Lists list box at the left side of this tab and then click the delete button that appears at the right side of the tab. You'll have to click OK in the confirmation dialog box that appears to delete the selected list. When you're finished creating or deleting lists within this dialog box, click the OK button to save your changes. Next we're going to look at applying a custom sort order. To apply a custom sort order, Click anywhere into the data table which you would like to sort, and then click the Sort button that appears in the Sort and Filter group on the Data tab in the ribbon. In the Sort dialog box that appears, use the Sort by dropdown to select the name of the field that contains the data which you want to apply your custom sort order to. Next, use the Sort on dropdown to select what you want to sort, and that will typically be the values. Then click the Order drop-down and select the Custom List command from the drop-down menu. In the Custom Lists dialog box, select the custom list to use and then click the OK button to return to the Sort dialog box. Here you can then click OK to apply the custom sort to the specified field. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.